trying to go over double search, double where what's been searched, go over it again, what hasn't been searched, anything that may have been overlooked, little pockets, things like that, that little sections that could have been overlooked that, okay, well now we're going to kind of try and narrow down into one spot here, one spot here, just trying to figure out everything. So just get as many people as we can and get their eyes open and get their eyes going. We, as a family, for my son's sake and for ours, we need to find something because once the snow flies, right? It, it, there, what, what, what can I do? At, at this point, I'd be, I'd be happy with the same colored thread of what he's wearing. Any sign of a direction we can at least go in, because right now we're just here on square one. Well, and it's actually easier right now than it was in July, you know, to be able to walk through the trees and look down and be able to move things around and the it, colors have changed yeah the colors have changed oh. so much and so to see a blue or to see the brown in that camouflage boot things like that is just easier and you know we're just we're asking for extra help because as many times as we've searched this and searched this it may just take one extra eye that happens to see that light blue color you know we're not we're starting at square one with we don't know you know everyone says if we believe he was abducted why are we back here because everything is we're we're day one okay we know as much as we did on day one and when you you know you could as you know as a parent you believe the best route which is that if at least somebody has him at least there's always a chance he's okay and i get him back we get him back right so but in order in order to even find there up here there's going to be there's got to be something up here to tell us where what direction to go in what what's what happened what's going on so what, what's your opinion on they you know the sheriff of Hat county said they were starting over from just as if it happened yesterday they're starting fresh probably not a bad idea i mean we we agree that because that's what we were thinking too is something but something's been overlooked something hasn't whatever hasn't been found is what we plan on finding what we're going to find we we we've got to i'm running we're running out of time the weather's not agreeing with us on a lot of this which is yeah, what we're doing right now there, there's too much ground to cover to 100% say that everything has been checked and double checked and triple checked every bit everything that's been you know like picked up and moved and anything that he could have got under or you know lost his boot or anything like that to show us a sign of where he was or which way he went or what happened there's too much ground to cover to say that we've covered everything so we're kind of doing that now and trying to get that done before the snow comes and so far where nothing's been found i want to go back through over everything again and anything that in my mind i don't think has been checked off even though the search and rescue and all that has done an amazing job i this the the truth of it is nothing's been found yet so you have to start back you have to start one. square one and i agree with uh sheriff bowerman i i agree with the officials that whatever that may be, whatever that may take, we're going to do it from square one again. And they, the pe people have thought the family asked nobody to come. We're trying to get, no, well, that's not it. It's just if everybody was coming up and nobody was checking in, and then we're going to have lost people, and those resources to find those lost people could be found used to okay. find my son. Well, now we got to sit, we're, we're, we're getting it. So this, see, the family's running this, and we're asking the public, please help. Please. We're going to, all we ask of you is to come in. Uh, put your name and your phone number down that way we know who's here and if you don't come back during a check-in time we know who's missing now so that way everybody stays safe and everything's fine and just help if you can help find my son if you have the time please do otherwise just th pray for us and thank you so we will be meeting again tomorrow at the Ledor store at 8 a.m. we're asking for anyone to please come join us um, we need as many people up here as we possibly can. It takes about 45 minutes in a good vehicle to get up here to the location. Um, we just need fresh eyes and we're just begging you please to come help us.